My musing for today is Comic-Con. It is a popular culture phenomenon. Been going on for decades here in San Diego with uh, other conventions all around the world. But the primary one, Mama and Papa, is Comic-Con San Diego. Uh, and San Diego is beautiful, of course. Great place to come to. Why do people go to Comic-Con? Why is it popular? Well, again, Comic-Con celebrates popular arts. Everything from movies to comic books to television shows, video games, you name it, that's Comic-Con. And uh, this year, I wanted to experience Comic-Con on the outside because we've been all kept up on the inside for so long. There are many attendees who've gone inside for the convention and panels and specials and that's great. But many people just enjoy the outside. I mean walking around walking around downtown San Diego is beautiful. So my musing is why go to Comic-Con? Well if you're a fan of those things, comics, uh, movies, television shows, video games, anime, then Comic-Con is the place you want to you wanna go to. So, when you get a chance, once a year, Comic-Con San Diego, always in July. And, man, this year, the first time in three years because of the pandemic, so it's nice. And uh, you never know who you might meet. Who, you never know who you might meet. You might even meet, I know you'll meet Star Trek fans like me, see? This is, from the next generation, command material. I think I might be a good commander. I'm not sure, but hey. <laughs> hey, here's, here's our experience. I went to Comic-Con uh, on the streets with my wife, Patricia, her sister, Yolanda, and our niece, Anjali. And here is our experience. It's Comic Con. It's pandemonium. There's people here. There's the uh, There's Yolanda and Andre. They're all here. Yeah, we're Hi, we're Hi, Hi, Hello, everybody. Say, welcome to Comic Con. This is a beautiful downtown San Diego, one of the best places to live in the United States, if they can afford it. Look at it. Look at the people. All the different people. All the Star Trek fans here. All the Comic-Con fans. He's wrong. Look at this. And the Convention Center rocks. Maybe I'm moving too much. And over here we got the sand map. And I don't know what we got here. Another trolley coming by. With Moriarty being uh, advertised. Just hard work to send you.
score. Let's score. The yes, last time quarter, San Diego. Oh, my God. Come on, Blake. It's a lovely, uh, a lovely thing to see. Here I am, Comic Con 2022, San Diego. Look at Star Trek. Look at Star Trek. Look at the Star Trek. And many things popular culture. Look at this. Thank you. Thank you.
Off, this is a Beavis and Butthead commercial. Spaghetti Factory, which is one of my favorite places in uh, downtown San Diego, Gaston, Florida. It's always been a favorite of mine. We'll take a break, drink Comic Con, eat some good uh, pasta, and then uh, get back out there and watch all the people. Because there's people watching from here. Looking for the cosplayers, the costume players. Enjoy it all. Good food. So, in conclusion, a lot of neat things, a lot of people watching, a lot of activities going on, but mostly people watching. And it's nice to be in a place where other people like similar things as you do. So, Comic Con is a place to go. I recommend it. Hey, it's only once a year. It's fantastic. Come on out. San Diego, California. And remember, if you like my videos, please subscribe and say you like and, and tell friends and strangers about it and hopefully uh, more people will, will know about this part of the world and yours truly, David Old Moravi. Take care. <laughs>